my name is Jacqueline and welcome to Yoga for Climbers with a focus on shoulders and heart openers. If you're not a climber, this is still going to be awesome for you if you find yourself, as many climbers do, in this position. Mm hmm yeah, I know, I see you because I've done it too. You're climbing, you're hanging out, and you're just resting like this. Like really, like why are we so sad? <laughs> Today we're gonna work on opening all that up and working on our posture. So all you're gonna need is your mat and yourself, and that's it. Let's get to it. All right, let's get started. Find yourself in a comfortable seated position. Find yourself, just surprise. <laughs> Go ahead and roll those shoulders back a couple of times. Close your eyes. Start to take a couple of deep breaths here. I know there's a lot going on in your life right now, but all that matters is this moment right here. Take those hands on top of your knees, palms to the sky, and go ahead and let go of all that breath. Take a big breath in. Open mouth, big exhale. Feels good, doesn't it? Two more times. Big inhale, fill the belly, the lungs, and sip a little bit more breath through your throat. And open mouth, let it go. One more time. Slowly flutter those eyes open. And when you're ready, go ahead and do a couple of nice shoulder rolls right here. Coming all the way to the back. Good, open up that heart. Hi. <laughs> and then roll your shoulders forward. Good, just kind of get all those muscles starting to move. Perfect. Inhale, reach those arms all the way up to the sky. Big stretch. And as you exhale, take your right hand down to the side. And then exhale, reach on over, open up that side body. Good. Inhale, coming on up. And exhale, open other side. Good. One more time each side. Inhale, up. And exhale, open. Inhale, reach. And exhale, open. Inhale, come all the way back to the center. Take those feet out in front of you, feet down, knees up, and then go ahead and take your hands behind you, roll those shoulder blades together, open up that heart, squeeze and lift, maybe even look up, up to the sky. Good, maybe even lift your hips off the ground just a little bit and then scoot your hips a little bit closer towards your heels. We're gonna make that nice and dynamic a couple of times. Inhale, press those hips back towards the hands. And exhale, lift those hips out and away. Good. Now this can be really intense, so just do as much as it makes sense and feels good for you. Really making sure here to let those shoulders go back and down away from the ears. There's a big tendency, especially when things are tight, to kind of come from here, yeah? We wanna open up, that's super important. Good, one more time, hips at the heels, shoulder blades together, look on up. And release, good, lift those he hips back all the way in, and then cross those ankles. Inhale, reach those arms up, and then exhale, go ahead and grab the outside of your thighs, and you're just gonna reach, reach and crawl your fingers over, and we're gonna just kind of stretch out those shoulders a little bit. Look over to the right side, and look over to the left side. Really subtle stretch. It gives you a nice moment to recalibrate from that really intense one we just did. Look over right side, and look over left. Good, and gently release, amazing. Let's go ahead and take ourselves onto the mat. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips. We're on all fours here. As you inhale, cat cow, look all the way up to the sky. And exhale, round out that spine, chin to the chest. Two more times, inhale, look up. And exhale, round. 
One more time, inhale, look up. And exhale, round. Good, bring yourself all the way to stillness here. Take the right hand, you're gonna place it behind your head. <laughs> I was gonna say your right head, but just your right hand will find the right side of your head. And from here, we're gonna do a little bit of mid-spine mobility to help really open up. You're gonna take that right elbow, lift it up to the sky, and exhale, tap that elbow to your wrist. Two more times, inhale, big lift, and exhale, twist. One more big lift and exhale, twist. Good, bring yourself all the way to all fours here. Left hand, left head. Inhale, left arm comes up. Hi, and exhale, twist. Good, two more times, inhale, lift. And exhale, one more. And exhale, take it down, good. Keep those hands shoulder width apart, feet come hip width apart, and gently lift those knees up and back into downward dog, good. You can keep your knees bent here if you'd like, you're gonna pedal your heels up and down, nice big stretch, good. Bend your knees a lot when you're ready, both of them, and then press your chest back towards your thighs. Really try to open up through that mid back, through the chest, good. Go ahead and release. Come back into downward dog. Heels as close to the ground as you can take them, but keep it comfortable. Two more times, inhale, bend those knees, and exhale, press that chest through. One more time, inhale, bend, and exhale, press through. Good. On your next inhale, articulate yourself all the way forward, and exhale, knees, chest, chin, take it all the way down. Amazing, looking good. Take your elbows, bring them right under your shoulders into this sphinx pose. Palms come out, and here, shoulders come back and down. Press those elbows into the mat, press those forearms into the mat, and really open up that heart. Again, tendency to come down here. Be proud, proud dumplings, open up the heart. Good, so we're now in the sphinx pose, feeling our heart opening, our shoulders, chest, back, everything's just like, lengthening and then when you're ready extend those arms if it feels good and open into that extended sphinx and release back down we're gonna do that two more times big press up and back down one more time big press and all the way back down good slide those hands all the way back to your chest press yourself up and exhale back into um, downward dog. <laughs> From here, bend those knees, look forward, and exhale, step or float those feet to the top of the mat. Take your hands to your shins, inhale, halfway lift, lengthen that spine, and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up to the sky. Big stretch here. Grab that right wrist and then exhale, press yourself out to the left side. So you're literally holding that wrist and then big press. Make sure you're digging or pressing through that right blade of the foot too. You wanna just feel everything open up. Inhale to the center, switch, exhale. Left wrist, right side. Good, hi. How's it feeling? You doing good? I know you are. Inhale, come all the way up. And exhale, cactus those arms, open the heart, look up. Good, just like this, nothing too crazy. It's just a little bit of a back bend. Two more times, inhale, reach up. Exhale, cactus. One more time, inhale, reach. Exhale, cactus. Float those hands to your heart and then dive it all the way down to the mat. Good. From here, you're gonna bend your right knee, plant the right hand down, and then left arm comes up and open. Good, so you're down here. You're really jutting that left hip back, feeling that mid spine. Option here to take this top arm and bring it around. Grab that thigh. One big breath. And then roll it around other side. Bend left knee, plant left hand, lift right hand. So many hands. Good, feel that stretch to the mid back. Little bit of those legs. 
good. And then go ahead and plant your hands here. From there, step back into that downward dog. We've been here before. Keep it dynamic. Inhale, bend those knees, press the chest to the thighs. Exhale, heels down. Two more times, inhale, bend those knees. And exhale back. One more time, bend. And exhale back. Good. From here, lift those heels slowly. Articulate that spine forward. Release those knees, release the chest and the chin. From here, you're gonna take your right arm out exactly to the side to a T. Bend that left knee and roll over onto your right shoulder. Let your head rest down and just chill. That's the best part. Good, we're getting a little bit warm. We're getting into those shoulders. Everything feels so good. Does it? It does. Good. When you're ready, peel back to the center. You're like, I'm not ready. I'm never ready. Left arm comes out, bend right knee, peel over onto left shoulder. You know, I can't see you, but I feel like you're doing good. I feel like your posture is really just solid. You've lengthened. Good, take it all the way back to the center. Slide those hands to the chest. And then this time we're coming into a cobra. Squeeze those elbows towards your rib cage and then lift the heart ever so slightly. Really make sure those shoulders are pressed away from your ears. And then take it back down. Two more times, inhale, lift and exhale down. One more time, inhale, lift, and exhale down. Good, press all the way back, curl those toes, and that downward dog. From here, little tippy toes all the way to the top of the mat until you get to that nice forward fold. Slide your hands to your shins, inhale, halfway lift. Lift the heart, and exhale, fold it forward. Inhale, sweep yourself all the way up to standing. And this time, exhale, open up to cactus. And we're gonna add a little bit more. Hands come to that lower back for support. Roll those shoulder blades together and give me just a little mini back bend. Nothing crazy, but shoulders together, heart is open, everything's lengthened. Good, one more deep breath in. And exhale. Good. Gently come out of it, really gently, really chill. Tuck the chin to the chest and roll yourself all the way down to the mat. Good, step yourself all the way back. Downward duck. Inhale, bend those knees, chest to thighs. Exhale, press down. Two more, inhale, bend those knees. Exhale, down. One more time, bend. And exhale, press. Good, inhale, articulate your spine all the way forward. And knees come down, chest and chin come all the way down. Release those toes. One more big old stretch. Roll those shoulder blades back and lift yourself up into upward dog. In upward dog, thighs are off the mat, shoulders away from the ears, and that heart is so super open. Make sure all 10 fingers and palms are pressed into the mat. You're feeling good. Awesome. Relax those knees here now and slowly roll it back. We're gonna do two more of those, keep it dynamic. Inhale, you're gonna roll yourself forward, back down. Inhale, lift up to upward dog. And exhale, take it back. Lots of spine articulation. Lots of work. One more time. Inhale, roll yourself forward. Take it down. Or exhale. <laughs> I lost track, I'm too into it. Inhale, lift the heart. I don't even remember what I said anymore. I'm like, I am an up dog. <laughs> lift that heart. And exhale, child's pose. You know, as long as you're breathing, it's fine. Whew. Good. Hang out right there. Awesome, awesome. Roll yourself all the way forward. Step back, downward dog. Good, from here, you're gonna inhale, take your right leg to the sky. 
and exhale, step your right foot in between your hands and then turn so that you're in a wide-legged forward fold. And if you missed it, just somehow get here, that's fine. Legs are out nice and wide. And just a tiny little variation here, you're gonna bring your toes in and your heels out. You're just gonna feel this nice little stretch um, through the front of the shin, which I really, really love. If it doesn't feel good for you, you can keep it toes facing forward, but that's your option. Let everything hang heavy here. Interlace your hands behind your back. Roll the shoulders together. Open up that heart. <sighs> Big deep breath. Woo, so much intense stretching happening right here. It all feels good. If you can, maybe keep those palms a little bit closer together to really tap into your shoulders. Make sure those shoulders are peeled away from your ears. One more deep breath. Gently release those hands to the mat. Toes come back to face forward. Hands come onto your hips, flat back, all the way up to stand. Good, inhale, reach those arms up. And exhale, hands to heart. Good, step your feet together. And last big thing here, inhale, wrap those arms around behind you. Grab opposite elbows if you can. Roll those shoulder blades together. Close those eyes for just a second. Everything soft, release all that tension through your jaw, release your eyebrows being scrunched up. Take a moment here. Feel grounded through your feet, feel strong through your heart, and just feel how proud you are right now. Be proud. You've done great work today and all of the days. Keep those eyes closed, release those hands by your side. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up to the sky, reach up, and big exhale, hands to your heart. Slowly flutter those eyes open. And you're done, yay! I know that was a really quick flow, but this is so awesome and easy to do before you're about to have an intensive upper body day, climb, or you know, maybe you've been sitting at your desk for a long time and you're like this, and you wanna be like this. <laughs> this is the perfect flow for those kinds of days. I hope you had a good time. I hope you're feeling all postured up, and I will see you next time. Bye.